But let me just say this. Can y'all hear me? Let me know if y'all can hear me. Uh, I'm kind of out eating. Can y'all hear me? Friend, friend, I just tried to help. I know you're tired of it. I just tried to help. Let me know if y'all can hear me. Okay, let me just say this. Cause friend, I was trying to get I was trying to get a bit further down. But let me just say this. First of all, Shamarco, Miss So called Wanna be Big Marco. Let's keep it a book. When you first got there to the house, you first you brought up Tommy Name. Let's keep it above. You brought up Tommy now and you stated and said that some about that Tommy was uh when I was trying to get when I was trying to get you to uh let's spend time. You brought up Tommy name. Yeah, everybody told me so, but let's keep it above. You brought up Tommy now. You talking about Tommy wanted me uh Tommy didn't want you to come uh come nowhere near me because I just want you to pay my rent. Let's really wake it up, boo. Second of all, Shamar, you know deep down inside, boo boo, and I have. In matter of fact, the person that's at my house right now, they even, they even uh, tell y'all, baby. I fed Shamar every time I when I had a day off. I fed Shamar, that for two. I fed you, Shamar. Three, you took it upon yourself to lie on my name and it made it seem like that I was charging you for rent money, and I told you that I wasn't charging you to stay there. You were trying to scam these people out of money to, to uh for, for whatever reason, which I don't know. You were trying to scam them out of money. I asked you nicely to stop using my name. Stop using my name to get money. Two, I even told you. I said, well, Shamar, I got the I said, I got approved for this apartment. I said, I got approved. Um, Okay, I got approved for this apartment. I said, I got approved for this apartment. I said, but it's a one bedroom. I said, I said, it's a one bedroom. I got approved for this apartment. I told him it's a one bedroom. Two. I told I said, friend, you probably just had to give you an air, uh, uh, air mattress. I said you probably had to get you an MF until you know uh, until I get approved for this. Uh, until, I'm working on getting a house. I'm working on getting a house. So I told him I'm gonna get a four bedroom house and let him uh, have one of the rooms, so he ain't gotta keep you know living pillow to pillow. I'm gonna get a four bedroom house so so he can live in one of the rooms. I did not want no money from Shamar, y'all. And this is my right hand of God. This is on my mama's head. I didn't want no money from Shamar. I can understand why Shamar got on live, which to tell y'all, it was to tell y'all that I wanted some money from him. I'm pulling him out. Now, now, now you got to pull out. Now, cause I'm eating. Now you got to pull out. You got to pull out cause for one, baby, the fuck is wrong with you? Then you get mad because when 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 the lady taking a long time replying about the apartment, you get mad because I said that I gonna go to a rumor house. That I told you that I gonna go to a rumor house, four bedroom house, and you be struggling and pretty messed up to run the thing. Cause I told you stop talking. Because I told you stop getting on live lying on me. Like I'm, like I put you out. You mad because I told you that? Then all that you mad because I said that? Well, tomorrow I'm gonna go to a rooming house until, until uh something come through. Not only that, let's really wake it up. You mad? But then not only that, tomorrow, Bubble Kitty. I also said you could come to the room with me. Before I even said something about the rooming house, I told you you could come to the room with me. 
and you ain't got to help me um you ain't got to help me on the room and, and i said you ain't got to help me on the room i said but uh, on the, i said don't let them come through before you know what i'm saying before the first i said i'm gonna go to the room house or whatever you took it upon yourself to go on here and try to talk about me Bash me for what? Cause baby, I haven't, I never disrespect you. I'll, and then I that boo boo, I fed you. You never cleaned up behind yourself. I had to keep telling you to, uh, Shamar, get into it. Shamar, get into it. Shamar, make sure you clean up behind yourself. Shamar, do that. Shamar, do that. Shamar, can you stop being loud? Shamar, can you stop doing that? Girl, you, and, so, and, and I still dealt, I still dealt with your bullshit. Girl, you is an ungrateful, you ungrateful as fuck. I don't give a fuck what you say about me, Shamar. And how I owe, and that's the thing, girl, how I owe him some money, boo, and you stayed there for free. Baby, you stayed there for free. You laid on my flow. You stayed there for free, boo. You laid on mama flow. Tell me, y'all, that turkey that's in the refrigerator. I never cooked it. So how you tired of eating turkey and I ain't never cooked no turkey? How you tired of eating a goddamn turkey? Y'all, that turkey that he talking about is still in the refrigerator. That motherfucking turkey is still in the freezer. So how you tired of eating turkey and you never cooked and I never cooked it? Make it make sense. I never cooked no turkey. Make it make sense. I never cooked no turkey. So how is you tired of eating a turkey and something that I ain't never cooked? I'm barely at home, Shamar. Even the person that's at my house right now, they will tell you. And then you laying around, you won't clean up. Girl, I had to make you bathe. So before trying to come for me and, and, and try to talk about me and know I ain't did shit for you. I never, Tommy, baby, I have witnesses, boo. So all this shit that he telling y'all on live, you, you be y'all be a dummy to fall for his bullshit. I never asked that man for no money. Y'all, that man they trying to scam y'all out of some money because he wants some money out of y'all. That man trying to scam y'all. I don't need no damn money from no damn Shamar. I don't need no damn money from no damn Shamar. That means the only trying to scam y'all out some fucking money. And I even told you, when, when I went live with Shamar, and this is the thing, y'all, I never went in there and bothered Shamar. I never went in there and bothered that man. I never went in there and bothered Shamar. But once again, I'm took the point. Darcy, I'm not gonna get on here and bash him. I'm not gonna get on here and talk about you know what I'm saying. But don't lie on me. What you're not gonna do, you're not gonna get on here and lie on me. That's why I don't fool with missing motherfuckers now. I don't give a fuck about it being cold. He should have thought about that before he got on live and bashed me. I don't give a fuck about it being cold. He should have thought about that. So like I said, like I said, when I get motherfucking home, he, he better have his shit out. Or if not, I'm going to set that bitch out for him. Come on, I owe you money. I don't owe you no motherfucking money. Let me tell y'all something. You be a damn fool listening to that from my ass. You be a fucking fool you listen at that man. I never ask that man for money. Never, because I'm barely at home. 
Well, tell them call them. What the fuck the cops supposed to do to me? Tell them call them. But he's sure going to be out in the cold when I get there. Tell them child, tell them child, I don't care. <laughs> what they supposed to do to me? The problem is he got too many people in his ear. You got all these people in your ear but won't give you a place to stay. Make that make sense. You have all these people in your ear but won't give you no place to stay. He claimed that he didn't get three hundred dollars, y'all. He said, he said, he said, y'all didn't. Get no he he said y'all didn't get him no three hundred dollars. He said when he got the money, he said he didn't he didn't make no three hundred dollars. Which like I told him, baby, I don't want no money from you. Like I told him, baby, I don't want no money from you. And y'all, I never asked him out for no money. I don't know why he gets on here. He lied to y'all like I asked him for some money. I never asked that man for no money. I ain't never asked that man for no money. So I don't know why he got on here and told y'all I asked him for some money. I didn't. I didn't ask that man for no money. I did not ask that man for no money. I didn't ask that man for no money at all. Like I said, I even told him, I said, I said, smart, I said, I said, I'm gonna work on try to get this house. I said, get this house or get a two bedroom apartment. And I said, you just get the other room. And, and, and I'm gonna leave it there. But let me just say this. Can y'all hear me? Let me know if y'all can hear me. Out eating. Can y'all hear me? Friend, friend, I just tried to help. I know you're tired of it. I just tried to help. Let me know if y'all can hear me. Okay, let me just say this. Because, friend, I was trying to get, I was trying to get a bit further down. But let me just say this. First of all, Shamarco, Miss So Called, Wanna Be Big Marco, let's keep it a buck. When you first got there to the house, you first you brought up Tommy Name. Let's keep it a buck. You brought up Tommy Name. You stated and said that something about that Tommy was uh when I was trying to get when I was trying to get you to uh let's spend time. You brought up Tommy Nine. Yeah, everybody told me so, but let's keep it about. You brought up Tommy Nine. Talking about Tommy wanted me nowhere near me because I just want you to pay me. As you can see, this is um, a live uh, priceless chick. Um, thanks to down in the valley, I was I was out yesterday. I missed a lot yesterday. <laughs> I was out, you know, handling my community business with my baby, and you know, doing school stuff and um, business stuff and. Hell, I, I came home, cooked dinner. Oh, let me tell you what I cooked, y'all. I did a shrimp 
and crab and tuna, and then I fried some fillet catfish and laid it on top. You talking about something that was good? We, ooh, we was all laid out in the den, uh, going to sleep. <laughs> Shoot, but you know, after that, you know, I was scrolling through Instagram and I just kept seeing about Shamar being put out. And I'm like, what the fuck is going on? So I had to hit who I knew was going to have it, and that was down in the valley. Okay, and I had this live, but I um, screen recorded this live because I want to, you know, say this. Now, last week, Priceless Chick came to me and asked me to take down two videos that I had of him because he thought they were negative. It was two videos and a short. And the short was um, really involving Shamar because I was saying that Price's Chick ain't learned his lesson from the last time. Um, Price's Chick was staying in the same apartment building as Tommy uh, when there was in Mechanicsville. And so Shamar went from Tommy's place to Priceless Chick's place, right? And, of course, somebody got in Shamar's ear. Shamar got the big head, smelling his damn self. And then, you know, I think Priceless Chick at that time had asked Shamar for, like, 30 something dollars to go towards the, the light bill. And, of course, Shamar had to sit there and talk shit, and he got put out. Okay, so, last night, I'm looking at, like... Here you go. It's the same motherfucking cycle. And then, you know, and I'm like, Price's Chick got the nerve to sit there and try to come for, for people. And people try to warn him about it. Because he don't want to see Shamar Nicole. Oh, motherfucking well. He can take his ass to a warming center. He can take his ass to, um, to a shelter or something. Y'all need to stop thinking y'all will be responsible for him. He has a disability in his damn body. Okay, y'all want to say y'all know he's slow. He ain't slow. He know how to go out here and fucking fuck. He know how to go out here and put uh, money on that man books. All right. He know how to go out here and, and do this and do that. He ain't slow. He got a disability in his damn body. Like, it's just a repeat cycle. You take him in, he talks shit, and then he gets put out. But I knew it was going to be something when Shamar was over at the shine. Right? Knew it's gonna be something. And I, and in my mind I'm like, mm, I guess he's gonna be with the shines now. And he and he probably will be. You know, I don't understand. Y'all know how he is. Jamar has access to a lot of resources, you know, a lot of us don't have access to. And I know he was on live last night and he was saying that he don't wanna wait. You know, it's a waiting list. Okay, motherfuckers a waiting list. You wait. Are you? And it's like, it's the same shit people be telling me, and he just, don't, he just think he's just too good for it. Motherfucker, you don't have a place to stay. You don't have a roof over your motherfucking head. You do what the fuck you got to do to get on your fucking feet. All he has to do is go to the shelter for, stay in the shelter for three, 30 to 60 days. He has to follow the shelter rule. He, he does that. They will give him a voucher to stay in a hotel. Okay, they will assign him a caseworker. Um, the caseworker will work with him and help him find an affordable place. Okay, you're going to have to pay rent. You want to do something. And then, you know, it, it goes on from there. You have a caseworker. Or, like I say, he can take his ass to Georgia Regional. You know, t tell them, you know, you're depressed, you, you need some help, and you're homeless and stuff. They, they'll do the same thing. They will sit there and give you a caseworker. They will help you find a place. They will furnish your damn place. Motherfucker, you have access to these fucking resources, and you don't want to utilize them. What the fuck is the damn problem? And he also want to sit and talk about, you know, he don't have his mama. He don't have his daddy. Your daddy passed way before your mama did. Okay? You, you have your sister, but your sister ain't with that social media shit. As far as I know, she got a YouTube channel now. You know, you don't want to follow nobody's rules. That's the fucking problem.
because you don't want to follow nobody rules. You want to sit here and be taken in by Price's chick, um, LaShawn, Tommy, and whoever else. But you don't want to clean up behind yourself. They got to sit here and tell your ass to take a motherfucking bath. Shouldn't no other grown person tell another grown person to get a staking ass in the fucking tub. Shouldn't no other grown person to tell you need to wash your fucking ass. Shouldn't no other grown person to tell another grown person to clean up behind themselves. That's just trifling and that's just pure disgusting. And then you have the nerve to sit here and try to talk shit. Talk about um, Piper Tea, all he had in the damn freezer was turkey. B- bitch, did you buy any food? Did you buy any food? What happened to the money that you were sitting there telling people that you need a thousand dollars for? Uh, a deposit. What happened to that money? What happened to the money for the phone bill? You put it on that boy books? Huh? It's a shame that you sit here and you want to eat up everybody's food. You want to be, you know, running everybody's utilities and be loud as fuck. But you can't even give them a damn dollar to help with anything. And and, and that's a lot of y'all fault. Because y'all keep coddling that, that, that man. He a grown ass man. You keep calling him. He has to fall. He has to fall. And he be he wanna, you know, he need it for himself. He has to want it for himself. You know, he wanna get up here and talk about, oh, I'm trying to get my apartment. You've been saying that shit for how many years now? And you ain't got shit yet. Your mama passed. And you could have paid the rent in that. You weren't paying the rent. You weren't keeping it clean. You you just Treating it like a, a damn band, though. All right? You had a place. You, you, you didn't keep it clean. You didn't pay no rent, no utilities, no nothing. But you want your own place. You want your own place. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. No. But, priceless, don't take his ass in no more. Don't take his ass in no more. And he, he doesn't say with everybody. He talks about everybody to everybody. He keeps up a lot of shit. He really do. He really do. Mm-hmm. But, you know, don't be telling us to take shit down when it's the fucking truth. And people are sitting there trying to tell you or warn you about, you know, what's uh, for coming. And you don't want to listen and you want to get mad. Uh-uh. That's your own damn fault. You should listen. Hey, it's not about listening. You should know better. Because he done done you like that um times before. You should have now you take his ass in. I, I understand that it's cold. But hell, that's he's not your responsibility. He is not your child. He is not a child. He's a grown ass man. And like I said, he has uh, access to resources that a lot of us don't. And he don't he don't take advantage of it. You know. And him getting up here and making threats and stuff. Let me tell you something. Every time he make a threat, I report. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. And that's why he paid us to keep getting taken because he wants to sit here and threaten people. <laughs> oh, and also, um, <laughs> Shampar said that, you know, he want the blog to stop screen recording him. And he want to go up to pay them days and we... we and come out, uh, y'all screen record me, but y'all got, got me blocked. You damn right. You think we're going to screen record you from my actual page? <laughs> Shit. Uh-uh. No, we're not. We're not. And and Shamar became a Bego host. Who Lord it? You know, you can't go in the Bego. And some people don't have money to be gifted. All right? You know, they make a comment, but if you're not gifting, they won't kick you out. <laughs> so, let me tell you something. That, that's the wrong way to go. Because people ain't gifting. You want to kick them out? Mm-mm. Nope. Let me tell you something. You, you, you won't get shit from me? <laughs> Guarantee you that. But anyway. um, But yeah, that that's what's going on. Price is chick and... Hit Shamar out, as far as I know, because I don't know where the hell Shamar was, you know, last night when he was sitting there talking shit about the bloggers. I don't know if he was at Priceless Chick or he was at, um, LaShawn's. Um, so, you know, it is what it is. Um, but, <laughs> that's all I got, people, and that's all, uh, uh, that's all I got on that. But you know how we do. 
we gonna kick it down in the comments and you know that's all for now <laughs>